orbiting Earth is about 5,000 satellites and 500,000 pieces of debris created by humans. And the only natural body in orbit, the Moon, is orbiting too. But recently, experts announced the discovery of another natural satellite orbiting Earth. In other words, a second moon has been discovered. This second moon is thought to have been orbiting Earth since about three years ago. Astronomers have long speculated that at least one other satellite orbits Earth. However, these satellites are relatively too small and dim, making them incredibly hard to discover. Until now, only one has been discovered. In 2006, the 2-3M sized asteroid 2006 RH120 was the one. This asteroid orbited Earth for 18 months, and that was both the first and last time. And a long time has passed. Astronomers officially announced the capture of a new object on February 25, 2019. This object appears to have a diameter between 1.9 m and 3.5 m, and based on its brightness, astronomers expect it to be a carbon-rich asteroid. Of course, it's not 100% certain yet. It could be either artificial debris, space junk, or a genuine asteroid. Yes, astronomers are leaning more towards the possibility of it being an asteroid. The reason for the uncertainty is that this asteroid has been observed only about six or seven times, making it challenging to determine its nature accurately. According to astronomers' predictions, there is a possibility that this asteroid has been gravitationally captured by Earth for about three years now. Despite orbiting Earth for the past three years, the asteroid was only discovered now due to its small size and limited time allocated for searching. The second reason is that this asteroid had a highly variable orbit. This asteroid was maintaining a very chaotic orbit between the gravitational forces of the Moon and Earth. Due to its constantly changing orbit, the time it took for this asteroid to orbit Earth also varied each time. Astronomers estimated that the orbital period of this asteroid is approximately one month, although it is not precisely known. Unfortunately, this asteroid is expected to leave Earth and move towards the Sun in April 2020. There is a possibility that during its journey out of Earth's orbit, it might get captured by the gravitational force of the Moon. If this occurs, it could create an exceptionally rare celestial arrangement known as a moonlet, which means a moon of a moon, or a moon's moon. If that happens, Earth might have a rare moonlet with its own moon. Scientists are hoping to observe 2020 CD3 again before April. If it completely exits Earth's orbit in April, it won't return to approach Earth until 25 years later. Anyway, by April, we will have a precise understanding of what happened to this asteroid. Let's wait together until then. Personally, I wish it could just settle down next to the moon since it's already here.